Generations Legacy Secret, the young man playing Wan Dil is actually a woman. Generation the Legacy actor's Zola son a woman is there any truth in this? When I first saw Zola's son, Wan Dil, the last born to his late wife, I actually thought he would make a very beautiful gay. He looked more like a woman than a guy to me. So this morning when I logged onto my Facebook I found posts about him being a woman and not a man. I don't know how true this is but I find it interesting and I'm looking forward to seeing his slash her part of the story or rather the truth to all this. I must say he slash she still looks good either way. Very yummy. Generations, the legacy actor, who plays the role of Juan Dill, has left Sophie's fans shocked, as it recently emerged that he is in actual fact a woman. The Zimbabwean-born actress Chidzum Hand plays the role of Juan Dill, Zola's son in the Sophie. She had many people fooled into believing that she was a man, as she flawlessly assumed her role in the South African Sophie. Legions of fans took to Twitter and Facebook to air their surprise. LOL I know that 80% of women were blown away and crushing on him, her. LMAO well Njapati she's not a man, but she plays a role of being Zola's son on Generations. Her name is Chidzum Hand. She's a Zimbabwean born, she moved to SA in 2006 and she studied in the University of Cape Town, read a comment from one of the fans. The young man who plays Juan Dill is actually a woman, no more crushing on her, Zola's kid. Not so long ago Karabo's long lost husband appeared on our screens to join the love of his life and his life got interesting to his fans when his gorgeous son started appearing from what I'd love to call small heaven the brothers are too fine and I must say the story seems real because they all have some sort of resemblance. But when his youngest son appeared on the screens I was like oh heaven officially lives in Zola's organs, he produces the finest sperms and I just thought since he has three sons maybe the youngest son was supposed to be a girl but God changed his mind along the way because he's pretty enough to be a woman but however he still looks delicious as a man. The allegations of him being a woman in real life wouldn't shock me much if they are true. Brains with a purpose, pure talented. The Zimbabwean-born actress and voice artiste, Chidza Chim Hand moved to Cape Town in 2006 to study at AFDA, the South African School of Motion Picture Medium and Live Performance. She was introduced to Cape Town's theatre scene as Lady Capulet in a 2010 Arts Cape production of Romeo and Juliet. Her theatre training extends to drama therapy, having worked with organizations such as the Bonfire Improv Theatre Company and the Zakini Arts Therapy Foundation. She is the voice of Siyaya and Al Jazeera's global health series Lifelines. Chidza hasn't responded to the questions posted by fans. Perhaps with that cat out of the bag the Sophie might have to come up with an interesting script to turn her into a woman.